Right. Now, I had wanted to just do a quick video, quick writing, you know, a few words across the screen, and let that be that. The only problem with that is that, uh, well, you know, people in today's day and age, uh, especially the younger you are, and it's actually even creeping up into the older people as well, people older than me, uh, is that in today's day and age, people do not have the attention span. Um, they don't have the attention span. Uh, they can't read a few freaking words without getting bored or, or, or some extreme ADHD or whatever the fuck. Uh, and if I wanted to get this out before people decide that, oh, well, I'm going to just write something without watching the entire video, I'm going to have to talk. I cannot entrust the vast majority of people. I cannot trust them to simply watch the fucking video, even though it's probably going to be less than five minutes and certainly less than ten. I can pretty much guarantee you that. So, uh, there's that. I'm going to have to talk rather than uh, save my voice. Yay. Anyway. Uh, okay, so um, this 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 whole Ariana Grande versus this bishop, or not even versus, but uh, Bishop Gravintides. Um, okay, so maybe he was trying to get some fingers full of tits, uh, which is bad. Uh, what's worse, at least on his end, is that if he was trying to do that, despite what he claims to the contrary, that he didn't at least pick someone with actual tits to grab. You know, I mean, <laughs> uh, I've, 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 I've spent enough time in the uh, stock rooms of Victoria's Secret and Lord and Taylor. Uh, the girl has no fucking tits. I mean, you've seen me. I'm not exactly the the fattest fuck in the world, you know what I mean? Like, I am hitting the gym, and I'm pretty sure I probably have... Well, let me not even say that, but I, I, I probably have bigger tits than her. Right? Most, most of the guys in the gym probably have bigger tits than her. Right? <laughs> I mean, fuck. Uh, I'm, uh, I'd be surprised if she's past an A-cup anyway. Um... Yeah, ask some actual tits to grab, or finger, anyway. Uh, seriously, um, if you're going to rob a bank, uh, why get a single roll of pennies instead of a duffel bag of hundreds, you know? But, hey, you know, that's who was there at the time. So that's if he was trying to get uh, some tits. Um, uh, okay, or maybe she was scrawny as fuck. And that could have happened to any male of average height with someone as tiny as her. I am six foot seven and 345 pounds. I could wrap my arm around both her tits and still hit my own fucking chest. <laughs> okay. It's impossible for me, me here, to hug any woman from the side without getting some tits on my hands. So, it's always some weird shit where either my hands are so low that it looks like I'm damn near at that, that, like they're damn near at my side, right? Or so high that it looks like the girl's in a straight jacket or about to get put in a headlock. And of course, this is like if they're at the side. If, if, if it's two of us at the side, we're about to take a picture or some shit, yeah. That's, that's, that's the deal with me and, and so far every single woman that I've... I've, I've Every single female that I've come across since I was what? 16? 16, I want to say 16? Yeah, 16. All right? If she was so uncomfortable, she could have easily moved his hand down. Much like my fucking prom date did back in 2005 when we were taking a professional picture. Simple, you know? Bad enough girls have told me that my fingers are long enough to give a girl a hysterectomy, and uh, I'm, I'm guessing I'm, I'm guessing they're joking, <laughs> right? Uh, you know, my palm was clearly at my prom date site, and I still managed to obliviously get some tits on my hands, right? Or fingertips, anyway. From the first crease of your fingers, I guess. I don't know, right? There isn't a single female, gay or straight, I guess a lesbian or straight, whatever. <laughs> homo or hetero okay past the age of 13 that doesn't know how to move a guy's hands down that's too high under 
or around her tits. Okay? Uh, it's just just that simple. There isn't one. Same thing if a guy's hands are too low on your ass or hips when you're dancing. Isn't that right, ladies? Hmm? <laughs> Is that not right? Like, whoa, hold up, hold up, hold up. Hands are a bit too low. Right above the above the waist. Above the waist. There you go. There you there. There you go. Yeah, yeah, isn't that right, ladies? Tell me I'm lying. I dare any of you women, any of you with a pussy, to t- tell me that I'm lying. Gay or straight, I don't care. Tell me I'm lying. Some of you lesbians probably have that problem with some of these studs out here, too. So, uh, d- d- fuck. Like, just, like, 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 get off me. Shit. You know? You g- g- gotta be fucking kidding me. <laughs> you girls have no problem making it very clear, damn near to the point of public spectacle, that the dude's hands need to come up now all right so there's no point in ariana making it so visible to the whole world that she is really or supposedly keep that last word in mind for later uncomfortable yet not go for the goddamn gusto and move his hands lower or completely off her i mean shit (laughs) you know i mean if you're gonna do it you might as well do the whole damn thing you let the world know that you're supposedly also un- uncomfortable with the whole thing with, with the way he's holding you, but you don't just move his hand off and be like, yep, well, shit. You know? <laughs> I don't see the point. Um, which leads me to one of my final points. Uh, it, it, remember that word I told you to keep in mind for later? Yeah. Um, here it is. Uh, did this Ariana character... Uh, did Ariana herself say that she had a problem with it? Not what you, oh listener, or anybody else out there, want to think or think is obvious, according to you. No, no, no. Did she herself say she had a problem with it? Or did everyone else, female, right? Or maybe even the pussy with males. There's still some of them out here in today's day and age. Jesus, fuck. Uh, decide for her that she had a problem with it. Blow it out of proportion, right? And Ariana better tow the goddamn feminist hashtag me to line or risk being hung by her clit at the town square. That's what I'd like to know. That is what I would like to know. Um, P.S. Um, yeah, I'll skip the fact that what she was wearing wasn't exactly fitting for a fucking funeral. Maybe the MTV Music Awards, maybe the MTV or Latin Music Awards, I don't know, but not this event, right? Okay, but I'd, I'd, I'd like to know, did she herself have this much of a problem with it like 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 is she rocking back and forth in a corner somewhere because some dude happened to well i mean i'll be honest uh, that 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 did uh, when his finger started moving that that mm, yeah. before all of that i'm just like okay big fucking deal but that part yeah 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 however <laughs> however right I've seen women uncomfortable with shit, and they had no problem in the middle of meetings, in the middle of whatever, letting it be known. Yo, they moved the hand, they 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 did all the stuff. They didn't care where the hell they were. Okay, so yeah, <laughs> you you women have no fucking problem when you want to. So yeah, um, okay. Now, which which leads me to the other thing. This apology from this guy. That, that, that is the other part that actually kind of sparked this video, right? Not even so much what happened here, that's one thing, but the apology from this guy is what sparked this video. Not even him apologizing, because if he didn't, then that would have been a huge problem, although he did, and everybody's still having a problem with it, so fuck, you know? <laughs> I mean, shit. Um, however, um, my question about that apology is why exactly uh did this bishop have to apologize to anyone but ariana herself and perhaps the family of the deceased Hmm? nothing happened to the i mean he had to he went and apologized to a bunch of people including the latin community the latin community the latinos the latinas what are you fucking kidding me Nothing happened to the quote unquote Latin community. Hmm? Selma Hayek is fine. Shakira is chilling. Catherine Zeta Jones probably couldn't care less. And of course, Mrs. or Miss or Ms. 
Latina herself, Jennifer Lopez, I'm sure her tits and ass or whatever else, wasn't harmed by what happened to some random fucking chola just because she's from the same camp. Except she's not from the same camp. I just did more research on this bitch than I'm going to admit to, and this Ariana Grande character isn't Hispanic or Spanish or Latina in the least. In the fucking least. And uh, I'm, I'm guessing most people don't know that. I didn't know that because I couldn't care less. I just, fuck. Uh, <laughs> as far as I'm concerned, Justin Bieber's from Brazil. Uh, uh, fucking... Uh, to fuck who else? Uh, Britney Spears is from Japan. I, I, fuck, I don't know. I, I do not keep up with this shit, but um, yeah, this bitch isn't even Latin. <laughs> okay, it's fucking crazy. Everyone back to her grandparents on both sides, from what I gather, is American, and as far as historically goes. She's 100% Italian. 100% of Italian descent, at least. Italian-American, but Italian descent. No Latin anywhere. Last I checked, Italians, be they Romans or Sicilians or, or otherwise, uh, they don't ID themselves as Hispanic, Latino, or Spanish. Nothing. No Spain. No, no, no. Okay? Yeah, this bishop had to apologize to an entire community. I don't know if he did that on his own and he got it wrong. Like, most people have probably gotten it wrong, you know? Uh, I don't know. But uh, an entire community. I have a problem. Uh, I'd have a problem even if he apologized to the Italian community. Why? Because he didn't do shit to them. I seriously doubt Monica Bellucci, if, if anybody doesn't know, uh, if y'all don't know who she is, uh, she is the girl from The Matrix 2, the one with the huge tits and the white dress, or white, whatever the hell, white leather, whatever the fuck she was wearing. Uh, and for those of you who really want to go further, she was that girl that, um, from that movie Irreversible, like the most walked out on movie in history, where she got raped in the ass by this gay guy for 10 minutes straight, and you got to see the whole thing, right? No, no censors or anything. Wow, that, that... That that was that was an interesting ten minutes of my life. I mean, because I watched the entire movie, I didn't. But that was a very interesting ten minutes, ten whole minutes of that. Wow. And any anyway, Jesus Christ. Um. Yeah. Um. I I I don't think Miss Belusi gives a flying fuck about Ariana. <laughs> okay. Even though they are more from the same fucking camp. They're both quote unquote Italian, although Belusi is actually Italian and, and Ariana just has some Italian uh, residue on her. Okay. On, on, on her family gene, gene pool, wine, whatever you want to call it. Okay. Uh, my question is Does Ariana even know a fucking thing about either culture or speak a lick of either language? Right? At least that. Fucking hell. Okay, so the reason why I'm going on at length about this is that I see no one from any other camp apologizing to all black people, and by black I mean melanated people from Africa or, or, or from Africa or of African descent, right? So all you people that are like one one trillionth black, but yet your ass looks snow white or like a hundred percent fresh from fresh freshly imported Asian, but you got one one trillionth black. No, sorry, not you. Um, yeah, I don't see them apologizing to all black people, the entire black community, when they fuck up against one of us. The direct person that got wronged might get a shit happens at best. Okay. Yeah, so for all these reasons stated previously, um, I, um, I believe everyone that has a problem with this whole uh, event that happened. Okay. At, at, at an event that wasn't about either one of them, but everybody wants to blow this thing up. Um, you all can just take it and shove it up your ass. You can take it up the fucking ass. Especially since the only person that was oh so wronged in this whole thing has yet to come out and say shit about it. 
has yet to come out and say how she was also scared for her life and also scarred for life. I checked. Done. Later.